Hello, hello, time for another chat with Nat. Okay, this is 212 Frasier, and last time I took you on the inside, if you're interested to see the inside of this property, I encourage you to check out my other video. I'm gonna show you this property because it may not be the house that piques your interest, but this property is something that is so unique in Ventura. This is a 20,000 square foot lot, and it is zoned rural exclusive. I thought I'd take you on a little tour. Of course, we're walking up the driveway now. You've got the oversized three-car garage. Uh, there's cabinets in there, all kinds of stuff to make it an easy shop. You have this covered patio out here and direct access inside to the family room as well as the kitchen. Over here, you have this grassy area That could be anything that you want. I believe that old shed right there used to be a chicken coop. Again, it's open to your interpretation. Now, you could expand this driveway, keep it going, and park a boat or RV. Put a large garden. You could put storage containers. They had two storage containers over here, which is why you see the kind of mounds in the ground here for leveling them off. Two storage containers. Could you imagine that kind of space? Are you paying for a storage unit right now that you could utilize a uh, an extra place to put things, equipment for your business, or look at all this. It could be parking. You've got two different types of orange trees. Um, seller said they are Valencia and Naval Orange. Over on this side, you've got two avocados, apricot, and it's just a massive property. You don't find properties this large, 20,310 square feet according to the county assessor. It goes all the way back to this block wall, kind of where this white beehive is. The bees are not currently here. But this property is just massive. trying to get a view where you could see from the back of the lot all the way to the front, but I think our trees are blocking our view. This place is so serene. There's so much potential. I mean, let's think of all the things that you could do back here. A pool, an RV storage, boat storage, a shop. You could put a tennis court or a basketball court, some sort of uh, outdoor fitness studio. You could do a large garden because it's zoned rural. You might be able to get some more animals. And when the building inspector was here, he said you could have the potential of putting four ADUs on this property. That's insane. There is literally so much that you could do here. It's just incredible. From upstairs in the second story, you get some of these mountain views that are a little blocked from this low. But the vistas are just breathtaking here. It's such a beautiful day today. And then of course you have the hillside this way, which you can see from the back. And from the side over this way, if I can get my camera to go the right way. So let's talk about lot size and what that means. They're not building any more land. 
They're not building any more California coastline. They are, there's never going to be more than there is right now. So that's why prices always continue to go up generally over the long term. It's because there's really just no more of it. It's becoming more scarce and more scarce. So when you have property like this, it's a major asset. The home next door, they have a front house, as well as they built two ADUs in the backyard. I mean, think about the rental potential of that. Uh, you could be having other people pay off your mortgage. Uh, if you're paying for a commercial space or for a shop, if you were able to utilize this uh, three-car garage, you'd be saving on your commercial rent. So it, it it's such a great opportunity for somebody that can utilize this property. And if that's you, please give me a call, uh, send me a text, and I would love to show this property to you in person. Um, if you need some referrals to lenders who are um, interested, uh, if you're interested in, in knowing what the rates are, what you would qualify for, I can certainly uh, pass you along to a couple people as well. Uh, I hope you guys are having a wonderful week and uh, take care.